As soon as you drive through the gates, you know somebody loves this place. It's tidy and it's attractive. You're right, of course, but it's not just one. Every member is so proud of Rangatira Golf Club. Richie, our greenkeeper, our sole greenkeeper, in fact, definitely loves the place, and why wouldn't he? His 65 is the course record, two better than Simon Owen. Mind you, Richie's had a lot more goes at it than Simon. Rangatira only has 110 members, but they all love it and will skite about their course at length. Arrive around noon on a Thursday or Saturday and they'll expect you to go into the draw and join in the haggle. Be prepared to negotiate because at Rangatira it's strictly rules of golf. In a four, the highest and lowest handicap play together, but you don't have to agree to the one, two, three competition. In spring, not even Richie can keep up with the growth at Rangatira, so comes together a veritable dad's army of past presidents and others all helping out whenever required. It's a club that really is a club, developed by members doing it all for nothing more than for the enjoyment of the game itself. Originally an uneconomic dairy farm, a very keen committee with only 200 pounds bought it way back in 1963 with then a lot of help from the bank. Showing amazing foresight, that group built Rangatira on the three terrace levels adjacent to the spectacular Rangatiki River. This golf course is one that absolutely stands out on its own. Easy walking, yet you drop several hundred feet during the course of 18 interesting holes. At the end, you catch Bernie's Bomb, our unique cable car that takes you effortlessly back up to the top level of car park and clubhouse. Rangatira's top six holes are the ones seen from the road, and while typical of New Zealand courses, aren't really seriously spectacular. Legend has it that a member with an intermittent hook landed his ball in a truckload of cattle bound for the Horatu Freezing Works, some 340 kilometres north, thus claiming to have the longest drive ever in New Zealand. If you're visiting and playing without a member, or perhaps playing with and thrashing a local, be careful teeing off number eight. This is especially true for men. Visitors have been known to mistakenly aim for the tenth. The rest of our middle flat hides no real surprises, but wait until you see the thirteenth. This par four with an elevated tee offers unforgettable views of the river, plus a peek at the bottom corner of the green. It's in touch for the big hitters, but a duff means dog tucker, and a slice for right-handers is off in the bush. Our canny members sometimes play a six iron down the middle, to set themselves for a full wedge and an easy par, but are not usually tolerated. We're not here for a haircut. Once through, the bottom flat is pure tranquility. Leaves Bonnie Doon for dead. Our clubhouse was built for the view. Whether you're inside or out on the deck, the outlook takes everyone's breath away. From here, unqualified engineers constantly redesign the ongoing Makahini State Highway 1 realignment. Artists paint pictures of the river and cliffs, and spectators offer that helpful, unsolicited advice to hapless golfers below who've come to grief on the 11th. Meanwhile, the occasional train crossing the viaduct brings hope to the people who believe the world's running out of diesel, even though electrification's not fully exploited nowadays. Midway on State Highway 1, between Wellington and Taupo, Rangatira offers a perfect break. Hunterville, 10 minutes south, and Ohanite, 5 minutes north, offer country hotels with good accommodation. There are also farm stays nearby and the club welcomes motor homes. Ten dollars if you want a shower, but otherwise if you're having a round of golf, you stay for free. Catering's available on club days and for pre-arranged groups. There are literally thousands of great golf courses in the world and New Zealand has more than its fair share. Our promise to you is that you will enjoy Rangatira, even if you do lose the beer. One thing we're absolutely certain of is that later when reminiscing in a 19th anywhere else in the world about your day at Rangatira, you'll find others not only know of it, but will also agree with you it's one course that definitely should not be missed. Rangatira Golf Club at the heart of Rangatiki, a gem in New Zealand's golfing crown.